Welcome back to the channel. Today we are looking at a simply supported beam, 9 meters long, which has a 30 kilonewtons load applied at B. The distance from A to B is 6 meters, and from B to C is 3 meters. It is simply supported with a roller support at this end, and we only have one vertical load applied onto the beam at B. Hence, we would have vertical reactions at A and C. Let's call them as RA and RC. Firstly, what we're going to do is take a moment about A. You can see that the lever arm is zero for reaction RA. Hence RA has zero moment about A, the anti-clockwise moment is due to RC reaction, and the lever arm is 9 meters is from C to A. So, we can write a moment about A is RC times 9. RC is causing an anti-clockwise moment as you can see, it would try to rotate the beam in this direction anti-clockwise, and then we have a 30 kN force acting at B, which is causing a clockwise moment, it would try to rotate the beam about A, in this direction, so we can write 9 RC is equal to, 30 times the lever arm, 6 meters. Therefore, RC is equal to 30 times 6 divided by 9 which equals 20 kN. Next, you can take moments about C, like before the lever arm is zero for reaction RC. Hence RC has zero moment, then we have one clockwise moment due to reaction RA, and the lever arm is 9 meters about C, RA times 9. We have this 30 kN force causing an anti-clockwise moment about C, and the lever arm is 3 meters from B to C. This is equal to 30 by 3. We can write 9 RA is equal to 30 times 3. Therefore, RA is equal to 30 by 3 divided by 9 meters which equals 10 kilonewtons. Now what we need to do is undertake an equilibrium check to ensure that the results we obtained are correct for the vertical equilibrium. For vertical equilibrium, when you add these two reactions RA and RC it should be equal to 30 kilonewtons, you can write RA plus RC is equal to 20 kilonewtons plus 10 kilonewtons which is equal to 30 kilonewtons, and that is equal to the applied force. Therefore, the calculated results are correct for RA and RC reactions. Thanks for watching. We hope you found some useful tips. Check out our website at structuralengineercalcs.com. Please like and subscribe, and let us know what would you like to see next. The human footprint is a masterpiece of engineering and a work of art. Stay safe. Goodbye, and see you soon.